What is up everybody, it's Buster Posey from the Minecraft Pigs bringing you another tutorial for modding Minecraft on a Mac. So let's get started. We are going to install today, um, it's called the Apothecarium mod and it is right here. So as you can see, it is, seems like a pretty cool mod. I think it allows you to heal yourself if I am not mistaken correct me with if I'm wrong as you can see you can make different stuff so yeah it looks pretty awesome let's get started so on this page where the apothecarium thing is you're gonna scroll down to the bottom and it's going to say not at the bottom sorry 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 it's gonna say um where the hell was it there it is right there download so you're just gonna click on that and that will take you to the downloading of the apothecarium thing and it will give you a RAR file just unrar it if you do not have a RAR converter just search online free online RAR converter and that will help you so we're just going to close that we're going to get mod loader if you already have mod loader do not download it but if you don't download it so you can see download direct and there goes mod loader and the last thing is Minecraft Jar Tool. I already have it downloaded, but all you have to do is click either Intel or PowerPC, whatever one you have, and download that. So the first thing we're going to do is go to our, not Applications folder, Downloads folder, and open up Minecraft Jar Tool. Now you're going to see this. All you're going to do, bam, open now. So MCTMP file comes to your desktop. If yours is empty, that means that you have um, installed mods before on a Mac, and you made your... Uh, Minecraft.jar file a folder um, doing the old different way, not using the Minecraft jar tool. All you have to do, go into Minecraft, force update, log in, get all the new stuff. So, in here, when we open it up, you'll see I have these uh, too many items classes. If you'd like to go to that video annotation right over here where the mouse is to go watch to see how to install Zombs and Too Many Items. So, once you have that open, I'm gonna do a mod loader, all of this stuff, drag and drop, replace, 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 apply to all, replace will go much faster. So once you have all those in, we're just gonna put in your downloads file, you'll see the apothecarium thing in there, open that up, and it's gonna have jar and read this. So you're gonna open up read this first, craft.txt. So look at that. It'll just tell you basically this is how to install it if you would like to know. But we're just going to do the jar and we're going to take all of these and you can drag and drop or you can copy and paste. I'm pretty confident that I won't get black, black screened so I don't do that. Basically how awesome I am. So once you have that, all you have to do is recompile now. Ba boom, And you are done. And I'll log in as Bubba even though I don't know if you noticed but I am not Bubba um, I won't put it on full screen just um, for the sake of trying not to get any lag but whoa as you can see I was doing the tornado mod on this so if you want to see the tornado mod click the upper right hand corner of the screen wherever left corner has been for the entire time how to install too many items. So, as you can see, when you have too many items, you'll have these different novice. I'll just give myself sumo dam. So we can experiment with this. Um, I haven't really looked around the mod that much, so I will just be, oh my god. Uh, we'll give ourselves some of this experimenting as we go crystallized slime so this adds much stuff to the game just time setting it <sighs> making sure it's all peaceful yeah don't want to get attacked by monsters so when you place down these I think if you right click them you can um, craft stuff somehow not really sure how you do that but you can look on the mod page to see all that stuff but I mean there is just so much stuff that you could do. As you can see, it says I'm a birdie. Yeah. Uh, whoa. I guess that's a killing thing. Apparently, or if I just OD'd on it. 
not sure exactly what happened there. But yeah, and then there's this guy, who is a dispenser. That's kind of cool. Not sure what the difference is, but yeah, that's a dispenser. Is that any different? Vial dispenser. Ah, so you, you Steve Master Alchemist Cauldron. Place down one of these. I'll pick up these things. What is this? Unnamed. Hopefully this won't cause any glitch. Whoa! So that bounces you. Um, we've got these other ones. Orange. Let's see what it does. Orange. Let's put a big line in it. Let's see what orange does. Does it heal you? Oh dear. Let's see. No. And yellow. Yellow, I don't know. Um, you should experiment on this more than me because I really don't know what I'm doing. So yeah, there's these different um, plants that we can probably find in the wild. So let's go check out and see. As you can see, there's a lot of wreckage from my tornado um, extravaganza. You guys are probably lagging a lot. And I probably won't be able to find... Let's just try something. Video settings, render distance, not far. So yeah. Um, this was the Apothecarium mod. Brought to you by Buster Posey from the Minecraft Pigs. Make sure... Ah, pig spawner. To like, favorite, and subscribe. Leave a comment telling me how perfect and amazing I am. And yeah. Um... As I fly into the sunset, I'll remind you if you want to go see the Too Many Items mod, left, upper left corner, and Tornado mod, upper right corner. I think that's what I said before. If it's not, the Tornado mod will be somewhere else on the screen. But yeah, make sure to subscribe because we have tons of tutorials, and we have lots of builds that you probably haven't seen, and we have tons more stuff coming. This channel is just getting started, everyone. So yeah, thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe. Adios.